Well, it doesn't matter because at the end of the day, it's either you have a perfect hand or your perfect meat. Block it, baby. I wouldn't be surprised if he concedes because, yeah, this play is kind of off the charts. How's it going, boys? And 3.5%. Today, we're bringing back green to the glory days. And this is the way to do it. We have one of the absolutely most overpowered and aggressive starts in the game. Evolving Adept into the Beast Caller. Or maybe, alternatively, a Gala Greeter into a Coda the Vestry. This combo is absolutely off the charts if you can get it in the early game. Go first, get this, and that means that all of your creatures have trample, and chances are you're getting two free lands on turn three. That is absolutely beyond reasonably overpowered. But beyond that, we have a late game, and our late game is nothing to scoff at. We have monkeys for survivability, we have Vorenslixes for a little bit of that greater evolution place, and the filer of figure this card breaks empires okay it's absolutely insane it's being in china for a reason okay and for a little bit more of that late game slash making our early game completely off the wall insane we have tribute to the world tree whenever a creature has a three a greater than three power it gets a card draw well we get a card draw same thing you probably know what this does and if it has less than three power put two plus one one counters on it which is very amazing honestly it makes all of your small ramp creatures insanely overpowered plus a little bit uh you know combo potential with the with the orchi and well the all the big stuff draws you cards so we're pretty good against almost all types of uh, control decks to a certain degree it could be better maybe but in our dreams only in any case 24 lands to be specific 2.8 average mana cost only and with that being said without any further ado let's just get a kraken and see what happens the hand of absolute champions this cannot fail unless our opponent counterspells everything we have which will not obviously happen because i believe oh wow he's actually gonna counterspell everything we have huh well in that case gala greeter go i want to see if he uh, reacts to this we do have vorenslix which means huh i'm sorry are we playing spirits that's cute not actually cute. Spirits are really annoying to a degree. Pushback. Okay, okay. I, I, I see how it is. I see how it is. It's a little bit annoying and slightly aggressive, but... Hmm. How do I want to play this? Probably want to play it like this. I don't want to go World 3 just yet, because I think he definitely is going to counterspell that World 3. And this is going to give us options. If we get a land, we can do some big things. If we don't get a land... Wow, wow, it actually is like Spirit Tribal or something like that, huh? Okay. Interesting, said no one. Ooh. Hmm. Vorenslix is serious pressure at this point. It would be nice to reamp, but Vorenslix has to be the play. Because we do get two free lands at that point. So, uh, we're gonna always be dropping a land. And we have card advantage, boys. And there's nothing more impressive than unreasonable card advantage. Plus, reach. Oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful when you don't have to deal with, you know, a, a lot of things. Well, admittedly, yes, he can kind of technically do that. But, you know... That's not the end of the world, technically. It's only part of the end of the world process. So, how do I want to do this? Let's see if he reacts to this. I, wa I want to see what happens. Nothing. Okay. Feeling a little bit cheesy, my dude. You got four mana there. I'm gonna, I'm gonna swing. No, actually, I'm not gonna swing. Hmm. Do I swing or what do I do here? I have... How much mana do I have? I have mana for monkey and whatnot. Well, if I'm not gonna apply... He's gonna push back, isn't he? He's gonna do some... I don't know what that does. Uh... Hello? Moshi Moshi? Enters the... Main, put a stun counter? That's illegal. Oh, well, that's also kind of dumb and illegal at the same time. Okay, okay, okay. This is fine. This is fine. 
You know why this is fine? Because he probably doesn't have any counter spells. Onichan is literally, you know, do it, doing stuff. And he can't counter this. And if he survived, well, he can't really do too much. Oh! Boys! This is big. We got the drop off, boys. Oh ho ho! And I'll draw. Did we already play the land? Yes, we did. Well, in any case, now let us just continue dropping things until it makes absolutely no sense. Man, flying is annoying. Okay, so how does this work? Tar uh, target creature. Oh, he doesn't want me to untap for Renslux. I mean, I guess I guess it makes sense. Why are they randomly getting protection? No clue. What is this? I have no clue. Each player chooses a non-land permanent they control return other easy easy okay i'm not sure if this guy understands what just happened but he probably does and he's probably pretty upset about it <laughs> he's probably pretty upset about it let's be real here okay how do i want to do this do i want to drop a varanslix is that reasonable now let's just drop this because it's a little bit more ramp <laughs> oh man, he tried so hard. And wizards tried so hard also. But look at this, it's too much life gain, baby. What you gonna do? Push back? Oh, 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 please! Oh, please, look at that. We're almost back where we started at. And this is really annoying. Yeah, this one, this one was like super annoying. Good game, my dude. I'm, I mean, there's no chance you think you can actually win at this point, right? This is kind of, this is crazy talk if you think you can actually beat us at our game. Also, do I want to drop one tribute? Two tributes could potentially mill us. But, you know, everything else is fine. Oh, oh. What, what, what? What, what just, uh, uh. What? What, 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 what do you, what do you, what do you mean you can just take that? How is th I demand answers. Do I create a treasure token? No, I think I pump up at this point. Oh boy. I actually do also one of these because, you know, I'm gonna tap everything so it doesn't matter. Okay, boys. Uh, this is as crazy as it gets. Onichan literally just decided to be as illegal as possible and... Oh, wizards. You're trying to make me lose, aren't you? But at the very end of the day, I'm gonna win anyway, because that's what we do here on this channel. We make the impossible happen because we don't understand what's happening most of the time. It's a beautiful, self-feeding problem, honestly, at this point. But, still good, baby. Still good. Okay, we got Invoke the Winds. Obvious taps were in slicks, obvious. But it's fine, because at this point, I... Hold all the cards. No, seriously, I hold a lot of cards here. So, do I drop this and just flip a fluke? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's do this. Let's do this. Okay. Gonna gain a little bit more of the uh, more of that razzmatazz. It's fine. He, I mean, he can try and do stuff. He, he, you know, he can he can do whatever. But first things. Actually, no, I can attack first, right? Yes, I will commence the attack. And I'm gonna call it the macaroon play. It's gonna make sense in a moment. Oh, come on! Wow, this guy is really annoying. Yeah, this guy is amazing levels of annoying. So what do I do now? Probably nothing. I just flip a floop. Probably get a um, Pyrexian Defiler. Or what's his, what's his face? Because I can destroy my own monkey. Because, again, I guess reasons. Got a, got a monkey, good. Let's see. Monkey? And what else? Uh, not much, honestly. Oh, we're kind of unlucky here with uh, with a little bit of that non-monkey uh, monkey stuff. Gonna gain some life, because why not? Gonna, gain, gonna create a treasure token. And this is keeping on pumping. Okay, that's also not that bad. Let's see. Am I milling my... No, no. Well, yes. I'm technically... When are my defilers? Wizards! I demand answers! What is this guy even doing? 
Okay, this is this is kind of not cool. At least I'm gonna destroy the uh, lost in the maze. But this guy, <laughs> this dude. Okay, this this absolute. Oh, oh my! I guess we win. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. It's completely fine. Uh, let's let's bump up this a little bit more. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know what you're doing, but I hate you. On a personal level, obviously. He's gonna pay this. How many times can he pay? Two. Is two? What is? Is this? Oh, okay, sure. Honestly, at this point, yeah, sure, sure, my dude. That's not even that bad for me, considering everything. Yeah, 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 yeah. Blah, blah, blah. Do, do it, do it, do it. This is two creatures. You're tapping two creatures, not big. Oh no, you're not. Wait, what? Excuse me. Did it just phase out and nothing happened? Okay. I mean, sure, I guess. A little bit sus, but so the phase. It Wait, how does the phase out effect actually cancel that effect? Huh? Man, I got questions. Well, questions or not. <laughs> At this point, questions or not. I, I I can just YOLO. Wait, do I just win by YOLOing? I think I do. It is what it is. Man, you were annoying. And this completely caught me off guard. But it makes sense because I wasn't on guard for it. So, yeah. You know, check, Matt checks out, as one might say. In any way, Karn Avatar, it's over! It's over! The best part of you slid down your mother's thigh anyway, so you should enjoy the moment a little bit, my sweet dear summer child. Nice. Also, by the way, that guy was a perfect example of what is technically a really powerful and good deck, but at the same time, it has a very key, uh, a very acutely visible problem, and that visible problem is simple. It's the fact that when you have a uh, when you have something like that, it's kind of good at surviving, but the moment you start to get overwhelmed, it's kind of completely joker for you. And now is a, a real test of our uh, strength and valor, boys, because well, you you all know how this works. Should I actually attack? Yeah. Let's push it. He doesn't block. Ex ex expected. Also, I probably need to start pumping HP with Galagri. Oh my! Oh my! Okay, that's not honestly that bad. So yeah, pumping HP with Galagri, they're like, there's no tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, boy. And... Well, I probably keep on pushing with that. Gain two life, that's very important here, okay? And flipping Polokranos is obviously going to be super huge. So, yeah. Need a monkey. Need to destroy this. <laughs> what? Why are you going to even attack? So, are you going to... Oh, yes. I mean, that's a good choice. He probably understands if he doesn't deal with that. It's it's just going to become be beyond reason unreasonable for him to control. So, yeah. I, I understand that play fully. But I do have life. Ooh! I mean, that's danger zone. That is definitely what you would commonly refer to as danger zone. But he's not gonna attack yet, and he's kind of out of cards. This is kind of annoying. But everything else. Pfft. Yeah. Okay, Anichan. I mean, relax. Oof. Oh, that is good. Yeah, I think our last game was supposed to be a forced loss, but we kind of absolutely shrek the guy. <laughs> so now it's now now things are different. Anyway, I can't even drop that, can I? Wow, what a time to be alive. Um, yeah, uh, uh, boys, I think I think we may uh, may be extremely dead, though. You know, j j j just a thought, just a possibility, as one might say. I need to do this because I at least need to get in an exchange. So, I got this, but I don't have the lands. A land actually is not even that good for me. Oof. Okay. Yeah. If I get a one drop, it's not actually that bad. Okay. St dude! St 
you, you can't just give this absolute barbarian, uh, you know. Oh, wait, that's good for me. Huh. That's actually really good for me. Can I flip? Six? Yes, I can actually flip. Hmm. Now those are some sprucey goosey options right there. He can do this. I think he's gonna... I think he's gonna panic do it next turn. Oh, he actually can... No, wait. Polkranos still has the reach, my boy. What now? Man, he should have gotten rid of Polkranos. I mean, that was not the worst play I have seen in my life, but it was definitely not the best play that I have seen in my life. Ah, uh, yeah, sure. Okay, so now it's uh, 10. So, I actually have a chance. As, strong, as strange as this looks, I mean, have a chance. But again, this guy... Bruh, stop just... Well, how many... How many things do you even have here, dude? Okay? And now... Four lands. Fifteen draws. I mean, yeah. It, it's it's kind of clearly a lot Joker here, okay? Admittedly, that's a good exchange. That doesn't matter. Do I survive? I think I don't, obviously, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, you couldn't get a better hand if you if you paid someone. Oh, we are back in business, boys, after that one. We got this, this, and this. It's amazing. What, what? Oh, 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 I know what you are. Okay, this is fine, because we have enchantment destruction. Keep that in mind, boys. And considering we're going first, it's not like he can do anything here. I love it. Ragdos? Oh, it's Ragdos reanimation. Oh, that changes some things, honestly. But it's not necessarily the worst thing ever. Haha. <laughs> Oh, he attacks, he smacks, he whacks. It's fine, it's fine. Okay. Oh, even that. Mmm, boys. I'm, we're talking big business here. This could be absolutely amazing. Well, it's gonna be amazing. Too bad we couldn't pump this. I, wait, wait, wait. There's no world. Oh, no way. There is no world where this guy is playing vampires. N Place your bids, boys, in the in the comment section. Vampire Andy or not? I mean, he could be a vampire Ragdos reanimation uh, dude, but I mean, why are they? Oh, wow, he's actually vampires. Ooh. Okay, that's that's a pretty good play, also not gonna lie. Uh, but we also have a pretty good play there. If we draw land, it's pretty Joker, but also didn't draw land. Still pretty Joker anyway. Because we are gonna have some absolute razzmatazz here, boys. And if we draw a land and get the Defiler up, it's... Oh, it's over. Oh, it's over. Okay. Removal? No way. Oh, actually, removal. What is this meme lordness? What is this? Annihilating glare. And a blood thing. Uh, okay. My dude, you, you, you need to relax here a little bit, okay? Uh... You're making a fool out of yourself. That's that's pretty much all I'm gonna say here, okay? Also, got monkey. Monkey means big win. Big win means monkey. And now we have... Well, if we get a land, we can play another world tree. But I don't like playing double world tree. This is a problem. A problem that we can solve by putting cat on purple. He's looking at our graveyard. He's he's digging through. He ha He's in a pretty good position, but... This is a 3-5, which is kind of ridiculous, honestly. Chief, please! That's not gonna achieve a lot, though. I wonder if he's gonna now go back to some kind of tried-and-true stratagem of, you know, doing MacGuffin things. I really want to know how this works. I can also destroy the cauldron with the sil uh, with, with our boyo right there. Uh, if you do that, nothing really happens, so I'm okay with this. He's just gonna pump it up. I'm completely fine with this exchange, obviously. Oh no, my coma! It's so saddening, but no one cares. Also, I wonder what would his reaction be if I double blocked. <laughs> Imagine that. Oh! Oh! Oh no! Onichan do is doing stuff, boys. Uh, here's a monkey, though. Ooh! Okay, okay. Listen, listen. This is how good things happen. This is how stuff goes. The cauldron, F it. 
doesn't matter okay we we got we got this he, he doesn't have it he does not he probably doesn't have actual removal which means we can cap the bullet the lies on it also he's a dirty unbeliever using lord squiggum's avatar which is heresy and last time i checked heresy is don't 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 let me finish the sentence heresy is illegal and attacking monkey is heresy and you know uh Lord Squiggum's avatars need to be punished. My win rate against fake Lord Squiggum's avatars is nearly 100%. Okay? It's it's undeniable. It's science at this point, pretty much. Okay, what are you... If I don't block, he drops another one of these and I lose. Oh my god, this guy is annoying. Or he maybe has some kind of BS that does stuff. I don't. I don't even know, dude. In any case, he can buff it up so uh, so it survives. But he can probably do some dumb things with this. Oh, he's no wait. That's that's not how you're supposed to do that. That's that's not how you're supposed to do this, Chief. Hello, Moshi Moshi. Yeah, that's not how you're supposed to do that. Maybe he actually does this again, who knows. Vampiric Vengeance, what a card. What a card. It's actually two guys in skirts, by the way, which is hilarious, but, you know, who cares? Anyway, anyway, anyway. What does he do now? Oh my god, another one. Another one. Okay. Oh, oh, that's another one also. Okay, how do I play this? I can actually play all of them. Sure, honestly, why not? Comb is gonna do... Oh, another comb. Ah, whatever, whatever. If I get a land here, I'm kind of pumped. That's good, that's actually good, that's actually good. Because it's gonna scale with the file of the figure. We in, boys. We cheeky. Okay, okay. So, again, remember. Flip pull Kronos. Amazing things happen. Don't flip full Kronos. And I'm sad inside. But this guy is also sad inside because he doesn't have too many options here. Oh no, Nietzsche does not have too many options here. Okay, so first things first. Blocking like there's no tomato. Now he's gonna want to get rid of the Vestwood. And that's the bait. If he takes the bait, he's done. I believe. Oh my god, he's taking in the bait. He's changing up the stratagems. Oh boys, this is good. This is good. This is good. Also, if I get this above 5 HP, I think there's no way that he removes it. Unless he does one more of these. Which I don't know what it does. Yeah. Well, it destroys creatures or planeswalkers if you sack an artifact or a creature. I guess that's fine. I guess no one cares. In any case. Ooh. He, he did a thing, boys. He did a thing. So do I do a thing now? I mean, I could. He has only one card left, and this is now uh, the big Razmataz. So, yeah. Gonna, gonna you cast it for normal mana, because I want those... I want those buffs, boyos. I, I, I want those buffy boys. Okay. And now, if I drop the Vestwood... I can actually ramp, but I, I need... I, I flip this and I win, okay? There's no reason for us to be hasty, to be anything, to be... What's that, table when You're saying I have uh, no balls? There you go. That's what you get for uh, being mean and nasty. I love you. Anyway. Uh, yeah, he concedes. Makes sense. Another perfect opener. Ooh, wait, another Ragdos? The, don't, no, no, wait, don't tell me. Okay, do I drop Gala Greeter because there's a chance that we don't get a third land? Do we believe? Oh. No, wait, actually, this is fine for now. This is fine-ish for now. A land? Okay, we're not risking anything, boys. We're actually in it to win it, boys. Look at this. Ooh, the beast caller. Damn, she can call me, uh, me a beast anytime. I actually don't like that. The gir girls who call you tiger are just... Well, they're, they're not always creepy, you know, but... 
Oh, it's just so off-putting, honestly. I don't know if that's just me, but it really, really feels off-putting for me. I hate that. Don't stop. Okay? So, so it's fine. Also, this guy's not doing anything. Woof. Man. Okay. Ooh. Well, it doesn't matter, because at the end of the day, it's either you have a perfect hand or your perfect meat. Block it, baby. I wouldn't be surprised if he concedes because, yeah, this play is kind of off the charts. Okay? Absolutely off the charts. And the reason it looked like clog because I'm clicking the exact microsecond, it, it displays the thing. Because that's literally how good I am. And that play doesn't achieve a lot because, yeah, we're, we're kind of back to square one, technically. So have fun. <laughs> Have fun. And here's more. Wow, did we just absolutely pop off like there's no tomorrow. This guy's gonna go to sleep and have nightmares about this situation. Uh, about how, how this could have uh, went differently. Okay, you see what I mean when I say Omega Pobet plays? Eight lands, three lands. This is turn five. Good game, good game, dude. I slap. Going second, four lands, two rampies, one polacranos. Also, boys, have you been noticing that in the last two weeks I have literally never went first almost? <laughs> there's, there's these periods where, where it's just, you know, days, literal days when you don't go first. And then literal days where you do go first. Stuff's crazy. Stuff's crazy. Anyway, do you think this is basic control? If it is, it kind of explains a lot. Let me attack first. I I, I want I want to test the waters. I want to test the water. Weakness, I feel it. Really now, March. Okay. So, do you think we're gonna get a uh, fair valued? There's a chance, boys. There's a sad chance that that may happen. It is what it be. Okay, okay, let's ramp it up. He has only three lands, but honestly that doesn't matter because we had the most unaggressive... What a jokester. We had the most unaggressive opener in the history of ever ever. So, it is what it is, boys. It is what it is. Okay, okay. He's gonna rat, but as long as he doesn't fare well... I mean, we're kind of stacked, honestly. Don't fare well me. You know, there's don't step on me me, but it's... Don't fit fail me, haha. <laughs> In any case, let's see if he allows this to happen. I think he has more counter spells. Yeah, no more lies. You know what's the well, what's the biggest lie, Humvee? It's the fact that you're adopted. <laughs> oh yeah. Also uh, weak, but I guess it is what it is. Anyway, uh, drop more MacGuffins. Do ta uh, do things, and at least uh, well now we're kind of hitting big. Okay. We're drawing, we're doing stuff, and hopefully he doesn't instantaneously just rat us on turn 5, because that would be exactly expected. Or farewell, because he's, he's ratting. Oh no, he didn't rat, he's an idiot. Well, he did do the thing that, you know, everyone else with a low, a low skill and zero talent does. So, you know, 10 out of 10, technically. Anyway... Bruh, we're bringing it back, boys, okay? If if Monkey survives, then Monkey survives. Vorenslik's in the house, Beast, Collar, Daddy. I have no idea what this guy is even trying to achieve here. Probably not much. Probably not much. McDonald's awaits for you. Anyway, destroy MacGuffins, acquire MacGuffinry. Okay, this is not going to be exactly in. Yo, you're dead! You're dead! It's over, Humvee! What do you mean, memory diluge? It's over! It's over! It's literally so over, it's not even funny. It's actually funny. But, you know, it's, it's completely over. Yeah, yeah, he knows. Wow. Last one, last one, I promise. Also, this is the first time we have uh, the Filer of Vigor in the opening hand. Ain't that crazy? Ain't that absolutely crazy? Also, that's kind of crazy. Let's start with the Lumi boy, because, you know, this scales better with counters. Okay, let's see what he does. Let's see what's the, what's the big play here. 
Mm -hmm. Well, that's a pretty aggressive opener. <laughs> I love it. Anyway, uh, drop it like it's hot, because, you know, I can. And let's see how this goes. I can double drop, which is kind of pover. Huh. Are you going to do something with that world tree? Huh? Huh? You going to do something? Do you, do you not like it? In this indistinctive. Hmm. Oh, or, well, indistinctive or <laughs> indecisive. Am I right or am I right? Anyway, starting off with this because he must counterspell something, right? Ah, he he resisted the urge of counterspellish. Okay, 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 okay. I still have the defiler of figure. And void rend. Wow. That's a bit unexpected. And unliked. So he could actually vrat us on turn four. Oh, God, why? Why does every absolute brainless plebarian play that thing, huh? Why? How does this make sense, wizard? Make it make sense. Every single time there's someone just playing this garbage. It's, it's a card that gets countered by almost everything. Like, there's a literal land that counters this dumbass play. And yet it happens constantly. Make it make sense. Are all these bots that are playing Temporal Lockdown. Literally, every deck has counters to this Ha! Oh. And he and he and he manually tapped, by the way, just FYI. If you, you know, that's that's it's funny. Anyway, Pelicranos, it is what it is. Okay, okay, this 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 seems a little bit problematic. Because when your opponent deals perfectly with absolutely everything that you have, there may be some issues with the chances of you winning. Now, we do have still this, which is big. But a lot of things are big in Japan. That's why it's called big in... <laughs> You're a joke. You're a... And the depopulate. I mean... Let's go, baby. Let's, let, let's go, baby. Uh, we, we do have the bear summoning land. And that's gonna be... Oh, that was actually good. Too bad we milled it. Uh, another land, I'm assuming, because that would be pizzazz. It wasn't a beast collar. I don't need a beast collar. <laughs> you think I'm gonna... Also, this bear looks ferocious. Bears are ferocious. This one looks extra ferocious, okay? This dude is gonna eat things. Things that a bear shouldn't eat. Like, look at this. It fought, it fought against a mech suit. And seemingly won, which makes very little sense, honestly. But, you know, it's, it's, I, I guess bear's gonna bear at the end of the day. Anyway, here's the land that we wanted, or did not want. Okay, milled some stuff, it's, it is what it is, it's fine. And bam, I'm gonna hit the planeswalker. I think we have no chance of winning. <laughs> we had no chance, boys. Hey, look at me, look at me. This I gave me a temporal back now because I'm such a good player. You're a disgrace to your family line. That's what you are. You're playing Kaito and Wandering Empress and Voidren of all things unholy. Like, make it make sense yet again, wizards. Make it make... And at the party. Okay, at this point, arguably our best play is allow him to get the Tefari emblem and mill himself in 15 turns. Well, probably by that point it's gonna... <laughs> oh, if stupid had a poster child, they, they call this. If stupid had a poster child, it would be you. Because this... Again, anyone who plays Jace with Wandering Empress because you think that's a good choice... You better ask yourself some questions, some hot hitting questions. For example, is this special helmet be there because I'm special in a good way? Or is this special helmet there because I'm special in the worst way possible? There's only two options. Even you should probably get it at this point. It is what it is. Anyway, we do have a pretty sweet coma, and he has a pretty sweet depopulate. He's attacking, cannot be blocked. It is what it is. Okay, so what's my play? Seriously, is it just wait until he gets the Fadi emblem and mills himself? 
Because that is actually a reasonable play at this point. Because it's not like he's actually damaging me. It's not like he can mill me. And we're probably going to be able to uh, survive for at least a small period or sliver of a time with uh, this thing. Oh. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Okay, he's drawing more. The, the mill win condition is probably not happening, boys, but it is hilarious. So, you know, maybe options. Okay, he untaps more stuff. Good. Another Kaito. Beautiful, beautiful. A defiler of figure. Let's go. Let's go, baby. Huh. You're gonna counterspell this. I mean, think. Think, my dude. And he does. And he and he's using the most obnoxious one. Counter target spell unless it's controller phase four. Look at the top four cards, put one of them in your hand. It's actually a pretty decent card, but I mean for well everything he's using is like questionable. And the funny part is, this is not exactly cheap. Look at this. Mythic rare, mythic rare, mythic rare, mythic rare, mythic rare. Uh, and, you know, yeah, the, 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 this guy's just doing this because he can. The, this is one of those guys who just spent a hun hundred bucks in, in the store. And Wizards is like, okay, okay, he has money and autism. Now we need to end Dumbo. And he's Dumboing above everything else. Well, at least he's creating tokens. I mean, this kind of works. And a sudden... And a sudden! And, and a sudden, because... A land! Because why not at the end of the day? I mean, surely this could not get worse. Uh, yeah, so, you know. SA spent a little bit of money, and, uh, well, he, he had, here's the result. He probably also bought this. <laughs> My dude's literal removal is temporal lockdown. This, and get lost. He... If he does not hit Chimmel, he actually has worst card draw and survivability than just than, than start the deck. <laughs> That's impressive. That's really impressively bad. Anyway, I think I'm done. I, I, th I think I'm pretty dead. There, there's very low chances that we're going to MacGuffin ourselves out of this because we have no cards that do it. So, uh, good game. Good game, my uh, pay-to-win enthusiast friend. It was it was close, as they say. Wink, wink.